Bloody hell. Thanks for the spot there, Chris. <laughs> How am I supposed to spot that? You want me to get one arm or something? I want you to straddle me. <laughs> you all you have to do is ask for that. <laughs> Sleep, mate. <laughs> That's always nothing to do with fucking with that. Hey, if you cancelled, I would have gone to sleep too happily. Happily. Something with that. Hey, guys. Yeah, really clever. That was good, actually. I'll give you that. I was going to like to play it off. I'll let you go first. What are you doing? We don't have enough time. What? Grab a set of dumbbells and move. Yes, sir. I'm so sorry. i got to warm up. Calvin, how big is your wrist compared to mine? Can you put this on? Your other hand? Yeah. Can't work out with that thing on. I guess you. You tell me, Mr. Olympia. <laughs> I love that. Say again. Say again. <laughs> How, how do you like being called, do people call you champ now sometimes? Yeah. That was my favorite thing I ever heard. When someone was like, what's up champ? I was like, oh shit. <laughs> Hell yeah. <laughs> right, come on then. Do you want to do a working set? I'll follow your lead. Of what, laterals? Yeah. What are you doing, like 12 to 15 reps? I don't know, how do you work? I'm usually 8 to 12 reps. Oh yeah. I've been doing a lot of like, one second hold, four right. second negatives. Yeah, yeah. Is that Honey got you doing that? What? Is Honey got you doing that? No, I actually have a guy, like a NFL, NBA guy who trains some, he does strength training for a bunch of pro oh, athletes. Nice. Yeah, and yeah, he's yeah. helping me do shit so I don't hurt myself again. Yeah. How heavy do you normally do? Really heavy. What? Really heavy. Really? No. Uh, <laughs> I train on my own now. I don't train like that. That's what I was just saying. The last two years I've trained on my own and touch wood. No, in, what? Touch wood, I've had no injuries or anything that way. Just been training a lot lighter, a lot uh, really? lighter. You've been more, training lighter now? Yeah, way lighter. But a lot more uh, control, exactly what you're doing. But and you want an Olympia like that? Exactly. Imagine that. I know. Put six pounds on as well, which was crazy for me. Impressive. For like 10 years, I never put a pound Would on. Would you say, what's the biggest thing you changed My this back. year? Just oh. your posing? Yeah. Not even your training, just your posing? Well, no, my training changed last year, so two things. One, obviously I was doing my back pose. I was hitting like, um, cause I always train with super heavyweight bodybuilders. I was yeah. hitting like a normal lat spread, like, you know, upright. And when I saw Steve, I went, why are you doing it like that? I was like, I've done that for the last 10 years. <laughs> so, what are you meant to do? And he just like, he pinched my lower back, put my chest up, and he went, see? And straight away, look at that. Yeah, it, oh, yeah, exactly. Is this that little movement? Yeah, exactly that. Maybe I should do med fatigue next year. That's it, mate. not even understand that because for me it wasn't like that at all. I came second twice yeah, exactly. and then I won and exactly. still I was like if this is a moment I've been training my whole life for you get it and it's always going to be like yeah that was it you know <laughs> and I don't mean to sound ungrateful no, but no. so but like I know you, you work so hard not even thinking about what it's going to feel like yeah, yeah and then you get that victory and then you almost like don't know how to Absolutely, enjoy it yeah. but that's what people are saying have you, have you enjoyed it like what's what's it done and I, I said all these things I was going to do with the title and like I can't yeah. even and then I've got it, I've done nothing with it. <laughs> just like, fucking. It took me three years to walk into it with like enough of a mindset where I prepped my mind to like be present enough to yeah. enjoy it, to then I when I got the wind to enjoy it, you know? Yeah, I saw so, I, I, some of your content when you were saying about you learning to be present and being yeah. there. Because that was my problem, like all I kept thinking, I still do it now and I'm trying not to, is like, 
right, what can I do with it? Or how do I monopolize that? Or how do yeah. I capitalize on it? Instead of thinking, just fucking enjoy just it. Enjoy just it. being it. Yeah. Well, you can have your whole life to capitalize. You'll always be Miss Olympia. Yeah. yeah. Are you gonna read for me tonight? I'm like, oh fuck, I want to be able There was, I can't remember what book I was reading, but it was someone talking about like leaving for all the time and traveling for work, and they were telling their kids like, I'm sorry, honey, I gotta go because yes. I gotta help, I gotta help make money, you know, support yeah, yeah. my family and all that stuff. And then the kid looked at him like, but daddy, what if I don't eat? Then do you still have to travel? And he was like, I literally started to cry. I'm like, yeah, fuck, okay. yeah. <laughs> yeah, that is it. Because my my. My brother-in-law took him to football today, which I take him to football. Like, yeah. American, yeah. Soccer. Oh, and I feel like that's what's happening. But yeah. she's been great. Amy's, Amy had a rough ride, mate. Yeah. Had really rough. Both. Both ones. Well, she nearly, I would say she nearly died. Well, no, she was close to dying with Elsie. And am I dying, Ryan? And I'm like, and she's like this, convulsing. And I'm like, no. <laughs> you fuck, I just froze. I was useless. Holy fuck. I was useless. So I just said to her, never again. No, nah, that's a fair reason to never have yeah. kids again. Not that mean. That's scary. I can't imagine. I, I, you know, I feel like we're both kind of anxious beings. Sometimes I just yeah. think of like how like already excited and connected we feel to this. If anything happened, I was yeah. like, you'd be so fucked yeah, up. Yeah, I know. Like, yeah, you would. I can't imagine having a miscarriage like at birth. I know. Like, but you know what? I don't know if I could yeah, yeah. To my friend, it happened two weeks ago at birth. Really? It was, she was uh, four days off due date. And it fucking, it was horrendous and he was crying. He's like, and I didn't really know him that well. He was doing some work at my gym. Yeah. And he, he just burst into it. I said, are you all right? And he said, she's having to give birth today. And I'm like, what the, what the fuck are you doing here? But yeah, brutal. Jeez. Yeah, don't focus on that. The dark side people don't talk about. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, so we had um, four friends around us at the same time. One, oh, yeah, it was just bad. Yeah. All, I'm not telling you because there's no point, but yeah, it was just, uh, it just made us feel very lucky. Canada. I miss my parents, my sister now that she's not here, but nothing else. It's just my family. Wow. Sorry? Would you not move out this way? My parents might eventually. My dad's about to retire. <laughs> Melissa and Ian, Melissa's not allowed in the country right now. So. Yes. How long is that going to be? At worst case, another year and a half. Oh, that's not too bad then. So, yeah. Kind of thing, I don't know if Ian wants to, though, so. Okay. Well, young old man, wise advice for you. The second Olympia win I got was one of my favorite. Because in 2019, I almost shouldn't have won. It was up in the air there. Yeah. And then I came back and I was like, I didn't really even expect to win. So that's a bonus. Yeah. And I didn't feel too much pressure on me because not everyone really was like, he should have won, he's gonna win. It was just like, can he prove himself? Yeah. So it was almost just my year just to enjoy it, have fun. Yeah. You've already got your win. Let's just prove what I want for myself, that I can do this for me. 
and it was way more like chill and it was one of my best looks. I was so chill the whole time, it was a great prep, but it was COVID, so I just didn't do anything else but that. And I mean, I know you have your gym and shit, but... Flex said that to me, he said, the first one's obviously good, but the second one, it proves not only to everybody else that you are, it wasn't a fluke, it wasn't luck, but to yourself. To yourself, like yeah. So the second one's always better than the first. Yeah. But like you say, you just so much on. That kind of drove me to do it though. So last year, because I, I had the British Championship, you know, the Ryan Championship, I had the newborn, I had the Olympia, I had the gym build, it's fucking mad. Yeah. I was on two hours sleep. I was training 12 till 2 at night. I was at 4 till 6 with my cardio. So I was on site. Was I hear you and I understand why you think that might be a good way why it helped. But I also think part of the reason it was harder to enjoy it was because you were in such a state of stress for so much and it was just go, 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 and all of a sudden you got it and you're like, what? Yeah. Whereas this year, I mean, your gym's not going anywhere. Yeah, yeah. If you want to retire next year, you can, whatever you might lose, you'll build back up, but you probably won't. If you just take your time, be selfish as fuck and enjoy that, your family and that. I need to, yeah. I know what you're going to do. Tell everyone else to go fuck yourself, you know? Go <laughs> Him? He's fucking nailed him. <laughs> hey, what's it out for you having on? Wait, wait, what? Wearing a hat on forward? Yeah, well, yeah. <laughs> yeah for, well, that's in there against all the rest of them, watch. Because I laid it. Get that, he fucking nailed everybody, look. You were smart, you started back here instead of so, beside him. Yeah, I was at the side and I could see he was just staring at me going, Daddy, Daddy, I thought, oh fuck, he's going to run straight to yeah. me. So I snuck, snuck around the room. <laughs> Can I get a picture of you, man? Yeah, sure. Yeah, dog. Like he's fucking dead. Are you doing this? Appreciate it, man. Nice to meet you. Uh, just till tomorrow. Yeah. Sorry? Maybe. It's up in the air. I haven't decided yet. <laughs> to the gym? I don't know where he's at. He's being lazy. We trained yesterday. What, sorry? I'm not. I'm going, but not competing, obviously. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, yeah. I'm having a bit of time now for the Olympia. Where are you going? Are you going? No. <laughs> Good man. Nice. Like, what do I think? Do I want to do more? Or? No. I was just asking your opinion on it, Chris. Oh. I can't understand like what the fuck you're saying with that accent. Are you being serious? <laughs> I'm not gonna do Chris. Hey mate, no, no, no. It's not that bad, is it? No, 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 no. No, it's because I'm I only have one ear that works and it doesn't work it's that not, well. I was thinking big time now, you just switch off, don't you? <laughs> no, I just can't. So hear. just Chris just say it, mate, just say it. In the background music, I can't hear anything. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Sound. Awesome, man. Thanks. No, wait. No worries. Happy about your baby? Yeah. Pumped. Yeah. Excited. I'm so mad. Yeah. Because he's so fucked up? Yeah. The last, You're not seeing it? The last episode. I don't watch that shit. I don't put negativity in my brain. I watch it's anime. It's not negative. And he just said he got mad watching it. Huh? Yeah, because he just bothered me with so shit. He said it's positive. He thinks Jeffrey Dahmer is positive. <laughs> Just how you look at it. The glass is always half full. Ryan Fetch is more than 10 by me. 19? Yeah, I'll go again, yeah. Was it 19 then? Your first one? First one I won or the first yeah. one I did? First one you won? 2019, yeah. Where's that gone? That's mental. What place were you that year? 
19. Third? You were up there for sure. Yeah, yeah. And now you're... Oh, yeah. I placed 8th, 7th, 6th, 5th, 4th, 3rd, 2nd, 1st. Oh, mad. Last year as well, I was like... What year did you come second? 16. 2016, the year Courtney won. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, because yeah, me and Courtney, then we went on to uh, Korea. Korea together and stuff. But the thing was, um, that was the most frustrating year for me because obviously Hanny and Jeremy, they were like a proper team, weren't they? Yeah. And I remember I was dead centre in 16. If you look back at the footage, never moved. And then right at the end, they moved us. And then like the crowd just went, Whoa. so they put me back and then sent us off. So I was like, where does that fall? Like, what happened there? What, yeah. what, what? And then I come second, I was like, fuck. <laughs> and and he, how many had Jeremy won before that? Three. Three? Three or two. That was his fourth? No, that was his third, I think. Yeah. Yeah, I was back a bit, back I then. Back, back then, especially, they they used to be like, yeah. you have to like dominate the yeah, champ yeah. to move them out. You know, it can't be like maybe. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, I think it, yeah. Uh, see ya. What <laughs> ball part? With Tyler and Rob. Oh, yeah, I like know. You all walked away, and then the, every and then everyone left, and then it was just me, and I was just like, I, was like, I had about six of those today. Oh, yeah. Where we're in a group, and then everyone walks away, and I'm not very social, so I'm just like. <laughs> I gotta pee again. Yeah, that's it. Alright, I've gotta go and uh, brush, brush my hair. Yeah. <laughs> oh, now you're in the bed. Thank you. Thanks, man. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Days. The classic white kid, yeah. <laughs> no, I was like 12. Okay. I did that, look. You see that? I broke my knuckle, I pushed my knuckle back. And that's because then everyone was like, oh, yeah, we were fighting. I was like, no, I, I missed the putt at golf. I punched the putt. Oh, no. And then I could see the hospital in the distance. I was like, oh, fuck, I'm going to have to walk to the hospital. Guess I guess I broke my hand. I don't know. But I, everyone, when I tell people that story, I was like, yeah, I smacked her. He's a man. Back C bomb in the face. Yeah. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. wait. Let's get that in centre shot then. Oh, that's a gym. RT fit. <laughs> Endorsed. Sit. All right, what are we doing? Outroing? All right, kids. So that was a great workout by Mr. MP and CP Olympia. You've got to say that MP. People get offended if you don't say I that. know, right? <laughs> Training like some true tramps here. Yeah. But you know, we had a long day. We met a lot of people. So give ourselves a little bit of grace. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We had a nice little heart to heart at the end of the workout, so we're growing our hearts to get a bit emotional, aren't we, mate? That's what I do, you know? <laughs> I'm living the boys. life of like being a dad, so getting the dad bod. Oh, Just yeah. take it easy nowadays. It'll be rough. Too hard. <laughs> One day we'll actually train together and prep and actually train. Yeah. We're well, gonna have to have like lunch before so we talk it all out and then we'll okay, go. Okay, yeah, train. and then we're not allowed to speak. Some bullshit like that, yeah. <laughs> all right, fair enough. But that's it. That's a wrap on that. So, another Appreciate day tomorrow. You. We're horrible, this whole YouTube Wait, thing.